Water is common element, and it is used for many purposes like washing and cleaning. But the most important use, usage of water is for drinking. It is important enough for the body such that if we don't drink water for a couple of days, we will suffer from dehydration and get into serious trouble. Water is also used in a baptism ritual and it has a spiritual meaning of cleansing of sin as well as life-giving. In the first reading, the Lord speaks of sprinkling clean water upon his people to cleanse them of all their impurities and from all their idols. More than just cleansing the people, the water will also soften their hearts of stone and turn, in, turn it into hearts of natural, hearts that will be able to receive God's spirit that will make them keep God's statutes and observances. In the gospel parable, we hear of what, he, what hearts of stone are in the attitude and behavior of those invited for the wedding. Both readings will make us reflect on our baptism and also our corruption of sin. Baptism makes our hearts into hearts of love and to be faithful to God. Sin corrupts the heart and turns it into the heart of stone and rebel against God. Let us make a daily renewal of our baptismal promises to renounce sin and to profess our faithfulness of God. And let us ask to Lord God to give us hearts of flesh to love God and to love neighbor. That is what we are baptized for and that is also our mission in life.